This video will demonstrate how to install Levitin USB charger tamper-resistant outlets. Please be certain to follow all instructions and diagrams provided with the product. If you're unsure about any part of the instructions or you're not comfortable or familiar with working with electrical wiring, contact an electrician. When installing and terminating this Levitin device, have the following tools on hand. A flathead screwdriver, a Phillips head screwdriver, electrician's pliers, a wire stripper, electrical tape, and a handheld voltage tester. Installation takes approximately 15 minutes. The process shown follows general guidelines. Local codes take precedence. Be sure to turn the power off at the circuit breaker and use a voltage tester to ensure that the power is completely off. Now, we need to identify the hot wire. To do this, turn the circuit breaker back on. Carefully use the voltage tester to test each wire. The hot wire will be indicated by the tester. Once identified, turn off the circuit breaker to shut power and test to ensure the power is off. Use a small piece of electrical tape to label the hot wire. Note that this device cannot be used for separate feed applications. If the outlet you're replacing has the top and bottom outlets controlled by separate circuit breakers, you cannot use this device. In this example, there is one black wire which is the hot, a white wire which is the neutral, and a bare copper wire which is the ground. Keep in mind, the color of the wires may vary. The hot wire may be black or red. The ground wire may be green or bare copper. If you're unsure, contact an electrician. Next, you need to be sure that the wires are prepared for installation. Start by making sure the wires are straight and stripped according to the strip gauge located on the back of the device. To wire, first, loop the hot wire clockwise three quarters of a turn around the brass screw. Tighten firmly. Next, loop the neutral wire clockwise three quarters of a turn around the silver screw. Tighten firmly. Finally, loop the ground wire clockwise three quarters of a turn around the green screw. Tighten firmly. This device may also be backwired. First, insert the black hot wire under the brass terminal clamp labeled hot. Tighten firmly. Next, insert the white neutral wire under the silver terminal clamp labeled white. Tighten firmly. Finally, insert the ground wire under the green terminal clamp. Tighten firmly. The device is now terminated. Carefully position all wires to provide room in the wall box for the device. Mount the device in the wall box with the mounting screws provided. Attach the wall plate. Restore power at the circuit breaker. To test the installation, Plug a USB-powered electronic device, such as a smartphone or tablet, into one of the USB ports. The electronic device should indicate that it is charging. If the device does not indicate that it is charging, refer to the troubleshooting section of the instructions. Your Levitin USB charger and tamper-resistant receptacle is now ready for use. For more information about this Levitin device, visit levitin.com slash USB.